Hello, welcome to your Tuesday edition of CNY Weathertainment. I want to encourage you to join in live. It's fun. And it's interactive on live stream, 5.55 each evening. You get a notification for it as well. Periscope at 6.05. It's another live broadcast, except it's a little less weather in terms of not as long, like five-day forecast on live stream, three-day forecast on Periscope. But it's even more interactive. We share some fun videos, some shout-outs, and some other things of interest as well. We have a contest that we usually run where you can win a prize as well. Three weather headlines. Unseasonably cold all week. Let's just get that off the table. The closest we get to normal or fine is Thursday. Even that, 50 is still a few degrees below average. Flurries in the forecast for Wednesday midday. It's not a big deal. Thursday looks like the rainier day of the week. But it's also the warmer day. So you get the rain, but you get the warmth. I mean, you know, it's six of this and half a dozen of the other. 53 is the average high temperature. Forget about it. We're not going to see it all week long. The closest we get is, as I said, Thursday. Well below for Tuesday, still below for Wednesday, and for Friday and the upcoming weekend. Sky cover. A lot of clouds around yesterday from that clipper that came out of Canada, bringing us the two and a half inches of snow in Utica, three inches in Oneonta. So it was exactly as forecast as that weather system departed on Monday night. This area of high pressure is the only one that's going to bring us sunshine this week. It's from a cold source, Canada. Had it been one of these two, it would have been brighter, longer, and warmer as well. It's not going to be. In the wake of this system, which came out of Canada, comes this system. And all of our weather is coming out of Canada for the next five to seven days. Okay, so that covers the clearing sky from Monday night in the wake of this system with the sunshine for Tuesday, but these still below average temperatures from that incoming high pressure system, which will bring a mix of sun and clouds to your Tuesday and not a great deal of wind, a little breeze out of the north and then the northwest as it moves across. The clouds will begin to increase Tuesday night late into Wednesday. Meanwhile, on the Almanac, we topped out at 28 versus my forecast of 32, so slightly colder than the forecast, very close on the low side, records not threatened, 1500s when you melt down two and a half inches of snow, that's how much liquid precipitation it would have been, and almost 13 hours of daylight. And before we get to the forecast, it is time for a reminder and a thank you for one of our sponsors, Picture Perfect Pools, which helps bring you your weather forecast in part anyway. Picture Perfect Pools, Route 5, New Hartford. Craig will take care of everything you need for your pool or an affordable spa as well. Proud supporter of the Utica Comets. Your forecast for Tuesday. Mixture of sun and clouds, cold for Tuesday night, mostly clear, cold, 18. Wednesday, pretty cloudy, midday, 11, 12, 1 o'clock, some flurries, that's about it, but just for about two or three or four hours. But basically just a pretty cloudy day with a high of 42 degrees. Then it turns warmer for Wednesday and we get some periods of rain showers, breezy too. Behind that storm front comes colder air for Friday and Saturday. Keep coming out of Canada. There'll be some intermittent flurries in the breeze Friday and again on Saturday. No accumulation expected. So once again, bright and cold on Tuesday, cloudy on Wednesday with some midday flurries, periods of rain showers early Thursday until Thursday night, and then lingering flurries with mainly cloudy skies for Friday and for Saturday. So if you want sunshine, enjoy Tuesday. It's the only day I see it this week. Take the forecast. Enjoy it and make it a great day.